In this video, I will tell you guys about all six children of Rudeus Grerad from Mishoku Tensei, Jobless Reincarnation. So Rudeus has three wives, and they are Sylphiet, Eris, and Roxy. And from these three wives Rudeus got six children. Rudeus has two sons and four daughters. And their names are, Lucy, Lily, Christina, Lara, Ars, and Sieghart. So, I will start with Lucy Grerad. Lucy is Rudy and Sylphie's daughter. When she was three years old. She had a tendency to run away from her father whenever he came back. Because she didn't see him as a father, but as a complete stranger which was caused by him often being away from home. Later on, she grew close to him, enjoying the time spent with him and complaining about his work taking him away from her. She has the same hair color as Rudeus. She also has pointed ears which is a characteristic elf trait. It is known that she is currently learning magic from her mother and Roxy. However, her current skill and abilities are unknown. She has also received tips from Orsted, and she watched Eris's swordplay, implying an interest in learning the latter. She once thought Orsted was her father, since his hair was white like her mother's. She was also once given a piggyback ride by Orsted, while she pulled on his hair. Like her father, she is not affected by Orsted's curse, so she is not scared of him. After her, next is Lara. Lara is the second sibling and first child of Rudeus Grerid and Roxy. It was said that she will be an important person in the future and that she is the savior that the Derudia tribe were waiting for. She has a strong look on her face and she hardly ever cries. The only time she really cried was when Rudeus was going to go to Sheeran and she didn't stop crying until Rudeus decided to take Roxy with him. She is also the legendary hero that the sacred beast is supposed to protect. As she is part Megurdian on her mother's side, Lara has telepathic abilities that normal Megurdians have, and she often uses them to speak to Zenith using her telepathic powers. It was discovered that she had this ability when Rudeus and Roxy took her with them to visit her grandparents. Her parents did not know that she held this ability, since that power skipped Roxy's generation, and Roxy was the sole person in the Megurdian village without that ability. Looking back, Hidegami tried to get rid of Lara many times, first by telling Rudeus to get the demon eye, leading him to miss Roxy in the port city, then telling him not to go save Zenith and Roxy, and finally, by leading Rudeus into a situation that would end up with Roxy getting mortally sick while having Lara. It's possible that Lara's destiny has to do with the destruction of Hidegami. After her, next is Ars. Ars is Rudy and Eris's son. Loves boobs like any other Grerit male. He especially likes his mother's breasts, but he is not limited to just big ones. He likes small ones like Sylphie's and Roxy's too large ones like Rinia's and Persina's. Like his father, he does not discriminate between the sizes. He does not care much for males and will cry whenever Rudeus tries to pick him up to hold him. He has red hair like his mother. He was the one child who Rudeus could not make it back in time to witness the birth. And he was named after the great hero of humanity Ars. After him, next is Sieghart Saladin. Sieghart is Rudy and Sylphie's son. He has green hair almost like his mother, and he had a face similar to his father. Rudius and Sylphie initially thought he is the reincarnation of Laplace and brought him to Perugius and confirmed it wasn't. Also, his real name is only Sieghart Grerid, he got Saladin's name from Perugius, and due to Rudius and his family already liking his name, Saladin became his middle name. As a descendant of Rudeus, a reincarnation whose soul originates from another world, Sieghart is immune to the effects of the curse placed on Orsted that induces hatred towards the dragon god and all beings that originate from this world. He is also immune to Hidegami's ability to cause people to have automatic trust towards him as a descendant of someone that comes from another world. Later he became the next death god and the number five of the seven great world powers. After him, we have Christina Grerd. She is the sixth sibling and younger child and daughter of Rudeus and Eris. Amongst the siblings, she is the one that is most open about wanting to be spoiled by Rudy. She's a daddy's girl and listens to him rather than to her mother's. Rudy was skeptical at Christina's attitude when she first attended Asura Royal Academy as she was naive. However, after three years, he attended her graduation and was impressed by her. After her, we have the last daughter of Rudeus, and she is Lily. Lily Grerid is the fifth sibling and second child of Rudeus and Roxy Megurdia. She is the younger sister of Lara and the half-sister of Lucy, Ars, Sieghart Saladin, and Christina. Lily has the same hair color as her mother and her sister Lara. 
She is a carefree person and loves anything related to the magic tools and magic items. She is a natural airhead and has no sense of direction, which make her often lost when she went back home from her workplace. So these were six children of Rudeus from Mishoku Tensei, Jobless Reincarnation. So that's all and thanks for watching.